they didn't want to talk about the way people pose in pictures. The way you pose in pictures can really tell a lot. It's all in the hands. Whatever you do with your hands determines if you're cool or if you're a stippler. Now, if you don't know what a stippler is, I'm getting ready to show you. Alright now, whoever that guy was, that's a stippler. Now, what you do with your hands, like I said earlier, it, it can determine if you're cool or if you're a stippler. Now, most people don't know what to do with their hands. One thing you never want to do when you take a picture is put your hands straight down to your side. I'm going to give you another example right here. Now here we have little Tony. Now he's surrounded by a group of nice looking young ladies. He's young. He doesn't know what to do. His nerves instantly kicks him into stippler mode. Notice the hands down by his side and notice his just overall stiff posture. That is a no. The stiffness syndrome affects all of us. It's, it's, it's inevitable. I've been affected by it. You've been affected by it. Your mother, your father, everybody gets affected by the stiffness syndrome. But the way around it is just simply do something with your hands. Anything. Now notice my hands. I can't tell you for the life of me what that means. The first thing that came to my mind, and I did it. My whole goal is to not get hit with the stiffness syndrome. Everyone gets hit with the stiffness syndrome at some point in their life. Whether you're old, young, big, small, tall, short, white, black, fat, skinny, ugly, cute, big, skinny. Anybody. It does not discriminate. You just have to remember the one thing. Never put your hands down to your side. Once you've done that, it's pretty much over at that point. Now, I'm going to leave you with these, a few more stiffer pictures, just to give you a heads up on exactly what it is. I'm in love with Mary Jane.